Hey guys, Bruce here, continuing my playthrough of God of War. Um, bad news and then kind of good news. Bad news is I went through like a whole half hour of this epic boss fight. And then getting to the next part and then it didn't save. Good news is oops, I was able to kind of load it. Um, I got it to about halfway through fighting the dragon, which it was kind of a tedious fight, so that might actually be for the better. Um, we got, we were making our way to the top of the mountain, we found a crane that would take us up, and on the way up, this dragon attacked us, and we kind of fought it back, and now we're outside fighting the dragon. So, yeah. Let's do it. Good start. to lower the crane on my mark. I do not care. Be ready. We did it. And you! Ah! Uh, but, 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 nobody's killed a dragon for hundreds of years. Not since the grand calling of the wounds. And unless I'm mistaken, you did all that for me. You are mistaken. The dragon was simply on our path, nothing more. You deny it all you want, but you saved me, and that deserves compensation. What are these? 
Rated mistletoe arrows. Straighter than Heimdall and perfectly weighted. Oh. Uh, thanks? Oh. Okay. Hold on. Uh, ooh, not that. Um, have you seen my brother again? Yeah. He said you lost your talent. <laughs> oh, and that I'm selfish. No. I'm sure that I value a weapon's look. No. Over its purpose. That I'm pretentious. No. And uptight. Burn that. I do not have time for this. No. No. No, no, no. Wait. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. I have a better idea. What? I just need a tooth from that dragon. A tooth. I pretty much that boss fight with the dragon. What I was doing at the end there is pretty much all you do the whole fight. So you didn't miss too much. Watch where you grab that. Oh, oh never mind. Oh, so unclean. Oh, so so unclean. Oh, oh the smell. Perfect. That should do. Oh. Yeah. I am not touching that. Just hold it out. <laughs> now, run that along the string of your son's bow. Just humor me. Atreus, your bow. Two passes should do it. Ah, gently, now. Yay. Whoa. Oh, sure. Now you're impressed. Um... Oh, oh I see. You figured it out on your own, then. Just... never mind. I wasn't just explaining the beautiful and complex artistry of my craft or anything. No, just... anything to help you. Yep. Psst. How about you, young one? Can you shoot me? They'll say Sindri. That should tide you over. For you, and back to you. Don't be a str-
Ranger. Mm -hmm. Alright, so that's everything I had. Huh. Feels like it wasn't that long ago we were hunting deer. Now we fought dark elves, and trolls, an ogre, and a dragon. I feel like we could be anything now. We win because we are determined, disciplined, not because we feel ourselves superior. Sure, I know. It's just it's not good to be strong, you know? Yes, I know. This is where I left off. So good. I didn't make progress again.
on the other side. I will never get tired of shattering things with this. Look here. Another. This one's called Emus. Mother tried to tell me this one, but I think I was too young. Are giants coming out of his armpits? I think that might be Odin's family. So this one, I just gotta find them. getting colder. We must be near the top. Not long now, Mom. Look! The summit! We're so close! 
Cessna. Your quiver. Strap broke when we fought the dragon. It's all right. I can hold it. Stop. A broken quiver will slow your draw. Pain we endure. Faulty weaponry we do not. This will do for now. Good? Steady, boy. Mind your footing. Must be somewhere. You hear those voices too, right? Yes. Be silent. Tell me. You know why we're here. That sounds like the same man who came to our house. You said you killed him. Shh. It must be important if the sons of Thor deign to grace me with their presence. Tell me. You two still tripping over yourselves to impress Daddy. He now travels with a child. Where would they go next? Why would I know that? You're the smartest man alive, aren't you? Is that Thor? Smarter than all the dead ones, too. You help me, I help you. Tell me where they are, and I'll talk to Odin. Your father won't let me go, Baldur, and he won't let you kill me. You have nothing to offer me, so take your questions. Take your threats, take these two worthless wankers, and piss off! When no one's looking, we'll be back for your other eye. Don't you forget, we're everywhere. We really are, aren't we? Oh boy. Ah, the very topic of conversation. A tattooed man traveling with a child. We took their path. Make sure we're all alone. But we just saw them leave. Do as I say. He doesn't know what you are. I would keep it that way. Who are you? Me? I'm the greatest ambassador to the gods, the giants, and all the creatures of the Nine Realms. I know every corner of these lands, every language spoken, every war waged, every deal struck. They call me Mimir, 
Smartest man alive. And I have the answer to your every question. Why does the son of Odin hunt us? Okay, there are a few gaps in my knowledge. Oh boy. But Odin's had me imprisoned here for 109 winters. I'm a clever lad. I can piece it together. I promise. Just give him time. Nobody there, just like I said. The boy's mother is dead. She wished her. She wanted us to spread her ashes on the highest peak in all the realms. Oh, then you've come to the wrong place, little brother. The highest peak in all the realms is not here in Midgard. It's in Jotunheim, realm of the giants. No! That could not be what she meant. Take a look. This is the last known bridge to Jotunheim in all the realms. See that mountain? Looks like a giant's finger scraping the sky. That's the highest peak in all the realms. No here. Can we just take that bridge? We have a Bifrost. When the giants destroyed all other bridges to their realm, they locked this one up with a secret rune. If it still exists, only a giant would know it. And all of them left Midgard a long time ago. True. But today, the winds of fate have kicked up a strange vortex of coincidence. Fact is, there's only one person alive who can get you where you need to go. And luckily for you, my schedule's wide open. We're going to Jodenheim, right? It's your best and only move from a tactical standpoint. It's the one place the man who cannot be killed won't follow you. What do we do? Yes! First, you need to cut off my head. Wait, what? And Odin made sure that no weapon, not even Thor's hammer, could free my body from these bonds. But fortunately, you don't need my body. The trick is, we need to find someone who can reanimate my head using the old magic. Old magic? Mm. There's a witch, witch of the woods. She knows the old ways. And she'll help. She might do worth a try. But if she fails, he will be dead. He tortures me, you know. Every day, brother. Wouldn't himself sees to it personally, believe me. There is no end to his creativity. Every single day. This. This isn't living. Very well. Oh, I can't watch this. I can. Chop this up. Mother. In case you can't resurrect me, there's something you need to know. Boy, the longer you wait to tell him his true nature, the more damage you do. He will resent you, and you may lose him forever. There is much about me I would not have him know. Uh, so you value your privacy more than your son? I'm going to cut off your head now. Good enough. Seems like he enjoyed that. Yona, hmm. we're going to Yona. We're going to find the long lost realm of the giants. That's. That's. Inconvenient. Yeah, that's just what I was going to say. Do you remember the way to the witch's house? Yes. The woods with the blood red leaves. South of the lake. I know just where to go. Hope she made it back from Alfheim and can bring the here. You seem nice. Before you cut off his head. There must be like a new game plus part of it, so I can get all the stuff that I'm looking for. So south of the lake, so I want to be here. I mean, I guess Brock Shop is the only place I can go.
Look at this place. This must be a branch of the world tree. Boy, stay on the path. Right, right, I know. I can't believe it was Balder that came to our house. The Acer was Balder. And you fought him and won. Yes. One of Odin's sons, Thor's brother. And now he's hunting us with the metals. Why is this happening? If we can raise the head, you can ask him. at you whenever you're twiddling your short and curlies. Leave him, boy. No, Pep. Well, you already soiled my solitude, so you may as well join me. You're not hungry. Good. It's not what I was offering. Saw your brother again. Congratulations. And I'm sure you let him go and roger my axe good and plenty again. Hmm? Let's see the damage. Mm, little canker throat wouldn't know proper weight and balance if it were dangling off his chut. Mm. He eaten well enough? I guess. Good. All better. Now what the fuck else you want, huh? Times he gets so wrapped up in his work, Sentry has a sense to sip or suck. And if he does remember, good luck getting him to cook his own meat. Guess I got all the stomach in the family. <laughs> yeah, along with the smarts. You miss me. That's bit, mister. What do you know? I just mean hey, that. Do you mind? Trying to concentrate here, already on a break from my break. I don't think there's too much I can do here. Something for the boy? Hey, whatever helps, right? Yeah, boy. Was that all there is?
it is the path back to the witch. First, we need to find a boat. All right, we will go ahead and call that one an episode. I really hope it freaking saves it this time. Um, yeah, sounds like we're going to the witch now. So join me tomorrow and we'll head towards the witch. This one, we had a lot of uh, progress. We found Thor's brother again. We found the new guy. I can't remember his name already. We cut his head off. We killed a dragon. We upgraded quite a bit. It was a good episode. Hopefully tomorrow we'll have some more progress as well. As always, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you all tomorrow. Have a great day.